A forensic audit, audit is in order for the city of Lynn Haven. This after Commissioner Judy Tender and a city resident dug deep into the city's spending history, finding many questionable expenditures. One in particular, the debris cleanup of a local park. News 13's Faith Graham has more. $330,228.14. That's the amount Lynn Haven paid erosion control specialists to clean up Bel Air Park after Hurricane Michael. Now, some are questioning if the park really needed that much repair. We were paying $1.50 an hour for the use of a blower in one specific project, and that's $16.50 a day. In one specific project, they were using 20 blowers. That discovery considered minor compared to what else was revealed. One day, November the 30th, they charged us $41,531.60 to clean it. On December the 3rd, they charged us, Bel Air Park and a little bit of James E. Rogers Park, $40,981.71. The price of the project is not the only alarming discovery. According to documents received by News 13, 55 people were hired to clean two tennis courts, a basketball and volleyball court, and a playground. Both Walker and Tinder voiced their concern. I don't know why we would continue to just wait and see, wait and see, because it doesn't answer any questions for how the city has been run in the last five years. News 13 has reached out to erosion control specialists for a comment. We have not heard back at this time. For News 13, Faith Graham, Panhandle Strong.